I just make till I get far and I rest a while and then make a pin. Pass off time. I can't just sit down. I work all the time. I can't just sit down. I can all the angels and I make Noah's Ark and I make Lake of Fire and the Devil. People are falling in the Lake of Fire. All like that. I used to be a preacher. I preached about 30 years. Hmm. Until my eyes went bad. Then I used to plow all the way away around you. I've been laying, living here 80 years. So I reckon you can see now that it don't take an audience for an artist. It take a materialistic audience. What make me feel good is to find all this material laying there. Nobody don't want to use it. It just invites me to come along and touch it. Pick it up. Look at it. I know more about material than the average man do because I go around and I turn over these little rocks. And I turn over, I go up underneath, I know what this is made out of. I know, I look at it closely. So it's all right if I've grown wise in that way that you all cannot. And I'm not, I don't like to pick at nobody. But when you don't know what I know, I don't think you can really compete with my mind. And if I don't know what you know, I can't compete with your mind. But I've been around. And I've been looking at some things. But the main thing about this is so beautiful. It's just so beautiful. Took a little time. I don't know. You may have a kind of calculate on your on your watch there to tell how much time it took. But I'm gonna want to have to come back and get this piece out of here. Uh, let me step back off of it and take a look at it. Rejoice! All these wonderful messages have been placed around me, you know. Awesome. We come into one of my doors that I've done, and I'll tell you a little of my story. In um, 1994, I lost three family members, which was my grandmother, my aunt, and uncle in a house fire. And I came out here where I was running this as an antique, a little junk here and there, whatever I was doing. And I came out here and I was devastated and I felt depressed. And all, I had all these grounds, I had, I had all these grounds. And I had asked the Lord, I said, now you done took three of my family members, what am I to do? So the first thing that the Lord didn't, he didn't come right away to tell me what he would allow me to do. He allowed me to go through a time of depression. And I went through a time of depression for about a year. And this is one of my first doors uh, right here. It says, welcome. Yay! Yeah, that is. Turn it blue. Ooh. 
Sometimes, sometimes uh, I might repaint a picture because I don't want them to look alike, you know. Some of them look alike, so I just rearrange them, you know, because this one kind of zoomed out. But so what I might, might do, put some landscaping. And sometimes I take, a, I take an art book with me and look at the old masters, how they paint, how close they together, like, like this painting here, how... I close together, you know. When I look in an art book somebody give me, and uh, I get ideas from the old masters, you know. The old masters, I get ideas, you know. I look at the old masters and and watch how close the people's ears and how, how I practice a lot, practice a whole lot. 